What's going on, Fight Fans? It's your boy, Ock, with Barack, the other sweet scientist from thisis50.com. And we're sitting down here with who I feel is, uh, you know, outside of Floyd, Floyd's not in the ring no more, so he would be the most popular and talked about American fighter, Adrian. The pr do you still call yourself the problem? Of course, I should. I keep getting it. <laughs> keep catching myself and shit. I'm staying some problems. Yeah, yeah. I mean, so, you, you know, you, you are, I guess, considered to some maybe from your hood or some people that see you on the internet, like you're more of a gangster than a fighter. Like outside of ring, it, it appears to be that way. But what, what are you? What is age? Are you a soul fighter or are you, or you can't leave that, that world? What keeps pulling it, you back in? It's not even that. It's just, you know, that's the environment I'm in. Right. You know, if, if I was in a different environment, maybe I wouldn't be in, in some of the stuff I'd be in. But, right. you know, quiet is kept. You know, I try to stay away from it as much as I can, but in certain situations, I'm going to do different things than the next man going to do because where I come from. I feel you on that, and I'm the same way. I came from the similar thing, so it's like what I had to do was I had to change the people around me, you know what I mean? Now, even though I might have been the wildest cat in the crew, mm -hmm. just having them still put batteries on my back because I felt like I was protective over them. Right. You might feel the same way. You are, Even though you're young, you are OG in your set. Of course. So it's like when 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 something happened, you got you got to step up. Mm -hmm. You know when you remove yourself from that because you can't babysit forever. Exactly. When you remove yourself from that, they're gonna say like, oh, A B, he really is a different cat. You know what I'm saying? They said he's trying to be. Mm -hmm. And I think that's that's what you probably need to do. I'm I'm on the verge of doing that right now. Though. Right. I, yeah, but how long does it take you to weed out all of those? those leeches, so to speak. Everybody has, no, okay, I'm, well, I'm, not calling, I'm not calling everybody a leech, right? right. But obviously when you attain a, a level, certain level of success and, uh, and you have some financial freedom, that when you, when you, I said, we talked to Danny Jacobs uh, last week about it. When you are eating at a restaurant, y'all drinking, people looking for you to, to pull your wallet out or your card out. I mean, you have to notice that. Are you noticing people like, man, this motherfucker always got his hand out. My niggas they don't do that. None of them like that. Because they not broke. <laughs> <laughs> don't know don't, don't, don't my niggas do that. Like, it's times where we fighting the, I got it, I got it, you got it, I got it. Like, like yesterday went to the mall and, and and my brother bought my outfit, shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like it, it ain't about. So you, ain't, don't, you don't have those type of friends around. Yeah, so who, yeah, so yeah. Who do you Not have? no more. When I was see now, when I was 21, <laughs> and I had 15 niggas with me in. Right, right, right. Bank camp, bank camp. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm talking about everywhere we went, and that's when I first started getting the money, real money, and right. it was crazy. It was, it was like that. But now it's just like. You probably don't see me with more than six, six people. You said you're in the process of getting certain people out of your circle. So maybe they're not asking for money, but maybe they're getting you into certain trouble. Talk about mm. the bullet holes finding an SUV. See, um, it ain't, it ain't cause of- the bullet holes or? <laughs> It ain't, it ain't. A lot of people be like, it's the people around it. It ain't none of my people that get me in trouble. It's just it, the shit I like to do. It's just in you. You know, that's what it come with sometimes. Yeah, that, you know what I'm saying? Like, like what happened the other day, um, I come home, I'm like, oh shit, my son got a basketball game. So I go to the basketball game. There's some shit going on at home, people beefing, and I'm cool with some people. So we just at the basketball game and they see me with them. So now I guess they feel like I'm in on. Right, right, so right, you're right, an enemy. Right. You look as an enemy. Yeah, and so right. now I'm an enemy. Right, right. Right? So we go to another game, go to the club. I'm like, man, it's getting too packed in here. I'm, I'm about to leave. So I leave early. So I'm at the light. I don't stand at, at, at night. At night, I don't see a red light. I ran the light, boom. So I'm just listening to the music. I'm by myself. The first three, doom, doom, doom. I'm thinking it's the music. I'm, <laughs> you heard three <laughs> shots. Bump, bump, bump. I'm like, doom. It, 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 it wasn't like, it wasn't like, it wasn't like, doom, doom, doom. It was like, doom, doom, doom. What were you listening like, to, by the way? A Boogie. Okay. So, and I'm like, what the fuck? Then a, doom, 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 doom. I'm like, oh. Then you realize it was shit. I, I've been shot through shot. this situation before. Right. That's the only thing that saved me. I'm like, I ain't panicked. I'm, right, I'm right, like, right, right. oh shit, they try. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I, know, I, I was in the car like, oh shit, they try to get me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, so you know, I, I get away. They still, they, they let and go. Did you see any cars by you, close to you? Or? Yep. I seen everything. Seen them suckers. 
So I you ain't know, tripping. So you know who did it? Nah. Someone. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what, what happened after that? After huh? you heard the shots, did you pull over? Did you go? Did you hit some of your dudes up? What, what was the next step? Get away. Yeah, because well, cause where, yeah. where, where I come from, they're supposed to get me. They trying to kill you. You supposed yeah, to die. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what the police said. You know, I ain't even, I ain't even know that. I just found out today that a couple shots went through the driver door. I just found that out today. Yep. So. I didn't understand why the police, cause, cause when I get, I get over the bridge, cause I don't stay in Cincinnati, so I get to um, Kentucky, and I'm still running lights. I'm like, that's why they got. That's why you got pulled over. That's why I got pulled over. Then when they see me, they was like, why are you running lights? There's like four of them pulled up. They're like, why are you running lights? And I get out like, shit, you see why? Motherfucker shooting at me. Right. So. So why would they think? Why would they say you intoxicated, impaired? You know what I'm saying? They looking at you. Nah, that that was um from 2014. When I got locked up for that, okay. I got locked up. Um, they were just on some dickhead stuff. So, but that video that was recently out, that was from that was when you got pulled over with the. Yeah, that was just that was just a that was just a couple days ago. But right. I had a warrant from 2014. 2014, when they locked me up, and um they took like they took like. Like forty, like forty seven hundred off of me. I never went to go get it. I didn't even know it. They still got the money over there and everything. I never went to go pick it up. I might, I have, I might have to. Yeah. <laughs> I might have to go. Have to go. Get that precinct. So, <laughs> so that's all that was. But you know, they, I had a warrant because I never went back to court. And shit, I went, I went to jail. They let me out. And then you in New York? I see you. Uh, yeah, I, I, it's over. I'm gone. I ain't, I ain't fucking with the city no more. I love. I'm so Cincinnati, I love Cincinnati to death, but so I gotta go. Spend more time. Go away, like move further away from Kentucky and all of that. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm I, yeah, I'm gone. You know that Moving saying? To the it, south, it, it's lonely at the top. You see how Floyd? You look at, you look at a man like Floyd. It seems like he's lonely because he can't be everywhere. Like, like you, you made it. You, you, you that figure out there, but you still everywhere. Yeah. And maybe that has to get cut sometimes. Cause like you no, said, no, but you I made it that way though. Right. You want to you want to be the guy. I made it that way because my uncle, everybody. my uncle always taught me. He said, "Don't ever shy away from your people." Like in my city, I can even even though it's a it's a crazy city. They, right, yeah. it's, they, they some love me a lot. Uh, a lot of people love me. A lot of people hate me. But I can still wake up and well, I I can I can go run outside right. and not get get bothered right. and shake everybody's hand. I go right. in the club, no security. I shake everybody's hand. Good. And I walked through the club, yeah, cause I don't, I, cause I never shied away from my people. Right, right, right. I don't, I don't, I don't shit, I don't talk down on them, I don't shit on them, no nothing. I respect everybody and they give me the same respect. But even, but even with that, there's gonna be people who hate you. Right? Yeah. And that's why you get fired at and stupidness like that. So it's like that's just being caught in the wrong place, wrong place at the wrong time. That's all it is. I was in somebody else's business. Right. Well, I wasn't in their business. I was just around. That's right. it. But that's sad because I was just really trying to come to support my ne- 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 my nephews and my. my but are you my the son? type of guy to try to get it, like get somebody to get in touch with whoever these people are, and let them know? Listen, I, I don't have nothing to do with that beef. I'm there. Or do you no. go that far? Or you just letting it ride. Uh, dude just got almost killed. No, I'm just saying. <laughs> it's, kind of, it's kind of past that. Like if you ever trying to <laughs> kill me, right? I'm not. I'm not <laughs> sending somebody to say, yo, I ain't with that beef. It's too late. I'm with it now. That's how I feel. So is that the mindset you have? I mean, you, you got to protect yourself, right? I guess in other words. But like he said, maybe moving away from everything would help the situation. I mean, because all this, doesn't it distract you from the sport of boxing? Nah. Not at all. Maybe we're harder.